Blessed, most merciful Heavenly Father, I come before you. I humbly beg, Lord, that you give me the will, the words, the wisdom to speak, what you put in my heart to speak. I pray in Jesus' name. Amen. I'm nothing but the dust of the earth, and no one is beneath me, but I am God's dirt. I want to tell you a little story. I sat in a restaurant one time, and I looked around, <clears throat> and I saw three other preachers, and I know there were several other deacons that was in the restaurant, <clears throat> all at the same time, all eating. I, I never saw anybody carry in a Bible, and I never saw anybody say the blessing. That's kind of sad if you think about it. I, uh, I'm asking Christians worldwide, born again believers, washed in the blood believers, to carry their King James Bible with them wherever you go. Whether you go out shopping, whether you go to the restaurant, whether no matter where you go, Walmart, or where, no matter where you go, dentist office, doctor's office, hospitals, wherever you go, you can buy these disposable Bibles for as cheap as a dollar nineteen, and I'll, I'll leave a link where you can get them. You can also take a rubber stamp and on the inside contact information for a church that you go to, that you attend, that you support. You can leave these Bibles in doctor's offices, dentist offices, anywhere there's a waiting room, hospitals. Maybe you can even go door to door and pass them out, ask just if they need a Bible. The Lord put it in my heart to do this some time ago. And and I, I, I've been working on it, but now I'm more sincere about it. And now I take my Bible wherever where I go. The Holy Spirit reveals something to me that we're so close to the rapture, and there's a lot of talk that when the rapture happens, that they're going to be claiming that it's aliens that zapped us up into outer space. I don't want anyone thinking that. That's why I carry my Bible with me wherever I go. If I'm in a Walmart shopping, if I'm in Denny's eating, and I get raptured out of there, my Bible will be left behind. My Bible is my testimony that I am a Christian and that I am, am, in, that I am in the saving grace of Jesus Christ. And that there won't be any confusion about me being zapped into outer space by aliens. They'll know because of my Bible as my testimony that I was raptured. So, I'm hoping and I'm praying that, that you'll join me and carry your Bible everywhere you go and that you also say the blessing in every restaurant. And I don't care, I, I, I eat at a restaurant myself that serves beer and wine. And some people might say, well, don't you feel a little uncomfortable putting a Bible on the table in a restaurant that serves beer and wine and then saying the blessing? Actually, I do not anything they should feel uncomfortable because when I can't speak to people my actions are, are my testimony to other people my saying the blessing is my is my testimony my carrying my Bible is my testimony when I can't speak to people and and I think that that you should be you should be doing the same I think that you should be carrying your Bible in these in these dark days we need a pushback against the darkness so I say, let your candle shine, carry your Bible wherever you go, and I pray for you all.